Alright guys, well it's December 21st? Yep. 21st. We had an interesting start to the morning because we're taking Ashton to graduation pictures and our dad like rushed into Megan's room and he was like, are you guys supposed to have lunch right now? And then Megan's like, oh my god yeah, and so we had to get ready in like five minutes. And now we're here taking him, so it's all good. Uh, but yeah, I had to like get ready in like five minutes, so. <laughs> So we just finished graduation. I'm with my mom right now and Megan went with her dad. I don't know if she's vlogging, but it is 1044 and Ashton's parents made reservations at a restaurant for 1130. So I think everyone's just heading there and I don't know, maybe with traffic, like we'll get there right at 1130, we'll see. But yeah, it went pretty fast. Yes. Honestly, for graduation, I feel like high school graduation took forever. <laughs> and then like every college graduation should have been too, hasn't been that long, so. We are leaving now. Yeah. All right, we're definitely early to the restaurant because we have reservations with everyone at uh, 11.30 and it's 10.45, but or I guess it's 10.50, we'll go in soon. But I left with our dad because I thought I'd be nice and walk with him to his car. Uh. Only just because you want to be nice. No, just kidding, I wanted to hang out with you. He loves me. <laughs> So this is actually brunch and it's like buffet style. So this is what we got first time around. They do have a dessert table. So uh, we'll I swear you just said dessert. Dessert. <laughs> dessert table. So we'll be going back later. But we got um, some bacon, potatoes, more potatoes, a uh, roll and eggs to start. Time for some dessert. <laughs> okay, so we just got finished eating at the restaurant. We were here for like, it was so a while. Good. Um, the dessert was so good. We yeah. had chocolate cake, chocolate covered strawberries. I'm full, that's for sure. So uh, it was actually a cool restaurant too. Like you, we got some clips too. Like I've never been to this restaurant, and you know, for it being Iowa, it's yeah. a rather scenic. Not scenic. That's not what I meant. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Like a good view. I don't know. Good view restaurant. Um. So everyone's like finishing up saying goodbye. Megan and I are in Haley's car right now. She's going to drop us off at our apartment so that we can finish packing and then we're heading out. And it has also, her and Ashton are coming back to Hawaii also. But they're going to Jamaica over break. How fun. So, so. I think they're leaving Monday. So, yeah. All right, I officially just finished packing. Honestly, not bad considering this is lights, the black bag. This is all camera stuff and microphone stuff, which means that I fit all of my stuff into that carry-on suitcase and a backpack for everything that I need to go back for a whole month. Sierra was way far behind compared to me. So let's see how yeah, she's coming along. Far. Are you bringing all those jackets? Yeah. Oh, wow. Some of it I might bring to Switzerland. So, yeah. I'm gonna, I have two suit suitcases out and hiccups. So I'm gonna like try using that. Cause I have it, a lot of stuff in here. And I have my backpack, which is pretty empty now since, like, I don't have anything now. Yeah. So this is pretty much just, like, uh, yeah. Look at how our dad made her bed. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what he was doing. And I have, like, those shoes, so. You bringing all these shoes? <sighs> this is what happens, like, every time we pack. <laughs> Megan packs everything in, like, one suitcase. I know. I Look at, I got it all in a suitcase in my backpack. Like, I don't know how you don't bring that much stuff. I'm just a light packer, you know. We'll see how much I can get. The good thing is that, cause like what's hard now is we have to pack for like the whole month, but like I can unpack when we get to Des Moines and like repack for Switzerland, you know? So yeah. not all this is like for Switzerland. Also, I'm like, it's gonna be a struggle coming back to Iowa City cause I know I'm gonna buy things like have Christmas presents to bring back. Yeah, so, it's gonna be, be tough. we worry about that when you get there. It takes up the whole side of the suitcase. You need to wear a sweatshirt and that on the way back. Layer up, wear heaviest pieces. I was like, should I bring this? No. Probably not. No, this is when we have to get to nitty gritty. Will I wear this in Switzerland or a rig? Probably not, because you're gonna wear like heavier jackets. I think, you know? I feel like I'll wear this, because I have t-shirts. Yeah. I want to get like a jacket to throw over. <laughs> okay, one side full. I, I literally have to sit on my carry-on suitcase 
like when I was closing it, it gets so full and then I have to sit on it and then I'm like, there's no way it's gonna fit. This is, was this the thing you said was like your most worn recent clothing item? Yeah, I love it so much. She wore it today. You guys saw probably, I'm sure, at least a little bit. But it's from Dillard's or Von Mar? It's from Von, Von Mar. Mar. It's the brand, in case you guys are interested. Because Von Mar, you know, you just never know. It's the brand Blank NYC. Really cute. Very versatile. Do a little French tuck moment. And then I like to fold the sleeves. I didn't today because whatever, but usually. <laughs> and then we've got, you know, we always have to bring back athletic stuff for filming and also, you know, working out. T-shirts, jeans. I only have three. That seems pretty good. I only have two. Okay, well. But, like, I also am, like, I'm not sure if I'm going to, like, get a new pair or not. So I'm, I'm bringing, nervous. like. Boom. Look at you. Bam. Three. Not coming. So just by leaving three things, Sierra did get everything into her carry-on. And then she put a couple other sweatshirts in here, her backpack. And then she's bringing that for some shoes. I think I'm only bringing one pair of shoes back, but I also know that like one of the boots I'm bringing on our trip is like my Christmas present, so I don't have it here anyways. Um, but yeah, look at that. She's done packing. We also have to go look at stuff in our kitchen and like fridge and dump out like our milk because otherwise it'd be gross when we came back. So we have to finish doing that and then we will carry everything to our car. So we're on our way back. We are probably a half hour, 45 minutes away from Des Moines, but I decided to try and be productive on this car ride, and so I've actually been thinking of some video ideas for TC2 that we want to do over break. We have to record at least five videos over break, but that's honestly just to get us like with stuff through break, and so ideally we will, we will record more than that. I'm not sure what our goal will be, but uh, I think we have like three or four video ideas right now that I'm like these are actually like video ideas where for once I kind of feel like we're not repeating video ideas and it kind of like it just is like new ideas and I'm like oh wow how did I come up with that and so hopefully we can kind of finish planning those uh, today or tomorrow because we're going to record on Monday and we're probably just going to try and record three Monday I think at the gym and then we'll find other days to record as well but I'm excited because I think that we've got some unique, good ideas, and I'm pretty happy with them, hopefully. Uh, we just have to work out the kinks and stuff and just, like, finalize what exactly the videos are, because sometimes, like, I guess how a video sometimes originates is just, like, me thinking of a title that kind of sounds good and then trying to be like, okay, what does that mean and how can I, like, work that into a video and stuff like that, so that's just kind of where we're at now. Um, I think ideally over break we would honestly record at like eight videos would be good, a good solid number. Um, and so we just got to keep thinking of some more ideas and planning out uh, when we want to be done recording because honestly Maggie is going to go to Colorado sometime around January 5th and then me and Sierra are going to go to Switzerland and so we have to be done recording all of our ideas and all of our videos before then. So we just have to make sure we stay on top of it. We are stopping at our grandparents quick because our grandma made us Christmas cookies and so we are picking them up. I think she made some of our favorites which are like the chocolate Hershey's Kiss ones with peanut butter. So that was a pretty quick stop. We literally just like stopped in to get cookies and like say hi. Um, so our grandma gave us the cookies in this tin. So if I can open this with one hand, I am gonna show you. So we've got these cookies, which are my favorite, they're the peanut butter Hershey Kiss ones, and then we also have some sugar cookies, and then I think these are oatmeal cookies, which I honestly forget about oatmeal cookies, but I like them. And then, what are these? The bottom ones? Oh, no, these. I think those are just sugar cookies. Just sugar cookies? And then, I don't know if there's more on, in here, I can't I see them. The very bottom has just plain Oh, butter. snickerdoodles, maybe? Oh, I thought it was um, And then also... Our grandma gave us a couple of ornaments, so I'm going to put this back away, and then I'll show you that. Okay, let's see what we've got in here, because I haven't fully looked. But I did see she got us a couple Coke things, because I honestly don't know where she gets these. But they're Coca-Cola ornaments, and I love, we already have a couple of them. Like, this is a can, and then this is, like, a shake or something? I don't know. Um, so there's that, and then 
We also have this ornament. I think all these are ornaments. And I'm not sure what this is, but it's like a little figurine. We used to collect snow babies, I guess technically we still do, but like that's just because our mom made us start collecting snow babies. So we usually get like figurines and stuff like that. And then I do think that's what this is because she said she didn't even get us a snow baby, but like what is this? Because that's what that is. So that is everything unless she like put something else in this box. So we just got dinner. Well, technically our mom got dinner. Megan's having some wings with like sauce for the I first thought, time. So I was gonna like say get like no sauce or like get the mild on the side because like years ago I did have like wings with sauce but I don't remember what kind of sauce it was. So I was like maybe it was mild like try that out. But I just opened this and it's on the wings and it's, I can already tell it's hot. Even but, though it's mild? Yeah. All right, so I'm having these almond encrusted chicken tenders. I'm not having all of these. Me and Haley are splitting them, so I'm gonna put some on my plate. We are currently watching the Iowa basketball game. Also, look at our mom's house. We probably, I don't know if you've maybe seen it in vlogs before, but we have a total of six Christmas trees. Mm -hmm. Our mom is happily over there just being like, mm-hmm. And 19 stockings. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. yes we do. Um, they're, it's halftime right now and they're ahead by eight. They're playing Cincinnati, so hopefully we can hang in there. Sierra's been taking a nap. Actually, probably don't think we're gonna be able to see the end of the game, so hopefully we have like a solid lead because we're gonna go see Jumanji at 10.10. So, like an hour. We just got back from the movie. It's 12.30. We're going to obviously end today's vlog. The movie was very good. If you like Jumanji, if you've seen the first one or if you haven't seen either, or like the, I'd recommend you know, it. first remake, not like that. I would say, like, you don't have to see the first one before um, seeing this one, but, like, it probably makes more sense, too. So, if you haven't seen them, you should go watch both. Mm -hmm. But I think they did a good job of, like, it was, like, the same kind of concept, but, like, it was also, like, switch up the characters a little bit, so that was fun. But, yeah. I love seeing the actors, like, the dogs. They're obviously hyped up. I love seeing the actors like take on different personas when they like switch the characters. So mm -hmm. that's fun. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and mm -hmm. we will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye.